Hi, I'm Cody with Wall Street Breakdown. Now, I'm going to give you a little quick statistical comparison that might, uh, that might not make Amazon look as competitive as they hope to be, especially considering the amount of money they spend on the streaming level that someone like Netflix already is or that Disney might, I mean, Disney might surpass them right out of the gate. Let's just take a look at some numbers that we got a hold of today. So it's fewer than 1 million people that have actually watched the latest season of Transparent over on Amazon. Now this is a critically acclaimed TV show. It's won numerous awards. I mean, people apparently love this. I have not watched it. I cannot tell you either way, yay or nay. I stick up my nose to the television and film industry. I don't care. I'm too busy. I'm, but other people, they love it, right? And that's their bag. Good for you. You know what? If that's what you're into, go hard. But a million people only, that doesn't sound like that's your bag at all. That sounds like a whole bunch of people jumped on board that like write their blogs and stuff and some award shows got all hoity-toity about it, but that's not really moving no units. One million, one million only. So Amazon spends 4.5 billion annually on producing and acquiring programming. That's not really translating number-wise, right? 4.5 billion to a million people watching this show that probably costs Amazon a lot of money to make. Now I know they're trying to get into this market space, right? They're, they're not the leaders here. They, they're making programming. We understand that. They're, you know, they're trying to make headway and you have to spend money to make headway. I mean, you take a look at Amazon's entire business model from the very start. They were always spending more money than they were making by such an extreme measure that, to be honest with you, through the early aughts, they were a terrifying investment to get into because you couldn't foresee what Bezos saw in Amazon. So, I mean, I'm not going to say that what they're doing is incorrect because they've based their whole business model on, you know, leveraging it all and pushing for the moon and it seemed to work out to this point right but 4.5 billion annually is a lot of money when you flip that over to netflix and you just talk about viewership that's that's all we're talking about now so in comparison to transparent getting a million viewers you think of the first season of stranger things that brought in 21.7 million over on netflix and the fourth season of orange is the new black brought in 23 million now I mean, I know it's apples and oranges. We've got, one, we've got one streaming service that dominates that one sector. That's all they do. Netflix just does that. Amazon does a litany of things. This is far down the, the chain of command as far as I would imagine Amazon's priority list. They do a lot of other things that make them a lot more money, things they've been working on far longer, far decades longer. But this is still allocated a lot of funds. They still allocate a lot of time. This is still something they're really trying to penetrate into this industry and become a leader, if not the leader. These statistics really don't add up. And this isn't the greatest news for them, but I don't think this really affects their stock at all. This isn't going to affect them going forward in a large scheme, but if this is a trend. If this is something that we see continuing, it's not going to matter how many critics pat you on the back. It's not going to matter... How many awards you win, that doesn't matter. At the end of the day, it's about the almighty dollar and how much revenue that you can generate. And when you've got nobody watching your stuff, that means nobody's paying to go and you know have access to your stuff. That means you're not bringing in money. And Netflix has ended up winning in this case. Man, I would have to give tip my hat. I'm not wearing a hat, but tip my fictitious hat to Netflix. I'm Cody from Wall Street Breakdown. If you haven't already, click the subscribe button and the notifications bell. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Have you watched Transparent? Do you think this is, do you think Amazon's going in the right direction? What could be done more? Are you an Amazon investor? Let us know. We like to hear from you. Leave a thumbs up and have a good weekend.